Welcome to behind the scenes of Clerks 3. Let's see how movies are made. Or this movie. This is Winona, by the way. Action! Um, we'll be starting in this direction with our boys and turning around and doing some stuff at the building. Three different sizes of shot. And we'll end, presumably, on a replicated shot, which feels right for this, this movie. Because the scene we're about to do where Jay refuses to dance literally happened. Uh, I did not take any creative liberties with this except change names. Uh, Jay was shy and refused to dance in front of what he called all those people. <laughs> and it was literally just Scott Mosier and David Klein. <laughs> so he insisted that they go inside RST video so that we could do the scene. So tonight, we not only replicate the moment in the movie itself, uh, which I'll be honest with you, when the movie came out years ago in 1994, there were a lot of people who would say, my favorite moment in that movie is when you and Jay dance in the dark. And that really insulted the writer who wrote all that <laughs> dialogue. So we're honoring that moment in the movie, but even bigger than that, in a meta, creative, meta way, we're stepping back and recreating the moment when Jason Mewes was too shy to dance in front of two people. Give it up for Jason Mewes. <laughs> Uh, let's start the last scene of Clerks 3. It's gonna be difficult, but we're pros and we're here to do a thing and we're about to finish that thing. So let's head into it. Uh, taking us into the end of the picture, man, our four heroes. Give it up for Austin, Trevor, Brian, and Jeff. How do you feel, Jeff? How do you feel, Brian? I feel good. We don't care how <laughs> Trevor feels. <laughs> I feel good. Winona, how do you feel? Feel good. Yep. All right, lock it up, please. Let roll down. Take a bite. Go and action. Dance. All right, where's our eye line? Um, it should be marked on the big camera. As an actor, it's very helpful to have an eye line. Even the bird knows that. She does. What are you waiting for? Dance. I ain't doing this. God. Can you guys go wait in the video store? <laughs> the video store. The RST. Ben, how do you feel that it's your last day? Great. Off the max. <laughs> Look at Jay in his natural habitat, trying to prepare for his scene. Look at that. They're trying to get focus on him. Jay's about to dance in his scene. Do you think Jay will be able to dance in his scene? When does he not? He's always dancing in his scene. Okay. We're gonna see a couple actors in this scene. But there's only one of them that's standing next to me professionally and personally for nearly 30 years. Give it up for a New Jersey icon, the one and only Mr. Jason Mew. Yeah! And standing next to him, you know him, you love him. Give it up for Kevin Smith. Hey! Uh, we have two more setups left, kids, and then it's speech and weep time. It's mine. That's my girlfriend right there. What are you waiting for? Dance! Why are you doing this with all these people watching? I only wrote this scene because you're always singing and dancing out here for the wee hours in the morning. No one's staring at you. Action, I guess. Right. Take a peek. Action. Let's do this one more time, and then we'll do the boy's These, those white dots are our marks. In case you didn't know, it's movie slang. 
isn't it? Oh yeah, here, ready? Whoa! And that's a camera movement. I still don't know who you people are. He's really in character. <laughs> an exciting prospect, but now it's a hellish one. The Abbey is uh, the last shot. Or is it the second? second to last shot. Oh, the second to last shot. It's because there was a guy named uh, Abby. Who was this? Abby Wu. Um, this is Leron, our a DP. D. Abby. Abby uh, I don't remember. He used to be a director. That no, he'd be, it was an AD. It was an AD. He would always say, "All right, this is our last shot, everybody," and then be like, "Oh wait, let's let's do another one. It'll be our last shot, everybody. Oh wait, let's do uh, another one." So they called it the wrong. Abby. Okay. Always wrong. So they named the second to last shot after him in his honor. The Abby Singer. Abby Singer. Was he an AD or director? He was an AD. And I believe the martini is is the actual last shot because then you can go get a martini. Yeah. I, Holy moly. The martini is when everybody on set drinks a martini before they do the last shot. Here we go. And action. What are you waiting for? Dance. That could have just been potentially been the end of the movie. Could have been the end. Let's see. Ah, uh, that would have been it if I remembered the rest of the scene. So, one more, kids. Go again. Second this, this is the real martini, right? It's still, it's still the martini. Oh, it's the second take. Oh, the martini. I didn't know there could be a second take of the martini. Oh, absolutely. You learn something new every every day. Take two, Mark. Might be, we might have just finished the movie. Are you excited? It's bittersweet for sure. One hour later. So we uh, are all just gathered here because I think. Is he, is he giving a speech? He's supposed to. It's his final speech. The director's giving a speech, I think. He's been in there like an hour though, so I don't know what's happening. Three hours later. That's literally the last thing I say on Clerks 3. And that's a wrap. Thank you for watching. And uh, if you want to see more videos uh, about Clerks 3, you can do, check those out here. Or uh, Sun on Lockdown or uh, anything else. Scary story stuff. It's all on the channel. Make sure to subscribe and like the video. Thank you for watching. Okay.